Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today we're gonna do. I got me dinosaur stegosaurus. Pretty cool, I got me. It's actually easy, I got me, but take a pretty long time to do that. So about like ten minutes for me, and it was my first time to do it, and this is what it came out like. So before I'm gonna start doing this. Let me tell you that, let me thank you to, every, to all of my subscribers and viewers that I got 50,000 views on my 50 videos, which is like 1,000 views a video and it's awesome. So keep it up, favorite, thumbs up, subscribe. So, and I'm gonna keep posting like I'm gonna keep posting videos every day. Good quality videos. Just tell me what you want me to, what kind of tutorial you want me to do, and I'll do it. Okay, cool. So let's start. Fold it in the middle. Two corners. Okay, make it two corners together. My paper paper is a little bit off, but it's all good. It's gonna look good anyways. Okay, fold it this way. So you got a case. Now you you bring two corners to the middle and fold it this way. Now you're gonna do it same thing on the other side. Just, just like that. Now flip it around and fold it to the middle again, middle line fold and fold it this way. And flip it around or just fold it that way. Now unfold all this two sides and just bring a corner to the middle, fold again, and do same thing over here. Now make sure it's like flat and fold good. Open it, get the corner, put your finger in there, and like make the paper flexible and keep the corner together and. Fold it this way, same thing on the other side. Just make a paper flexible, fold it. Pretty close to my paper. Okay, same thing here. Okay, unfold it. Grab that fold, make it flexible, and fold it down here. Same thing here. Okay. Now grab that like small looks like triangle and bring it to that line like that. Yeah, sometimes it flip, slips out, so it's all good. Just fold it back up and do the other side. Okay. That's good. And the other leg. It's gonna be legs at the end. So we fold it this way. Now we turn, flip it around and you see that corner and we bring that corner over here, make sure line is parallel to that line. Fold it real good. Unfold it and do the other side on the that same spot. We made it. Make sure it's gonna be on the same line. Okay. Now
flip it this way and fold it like that together other side to the middle line just like that so they touch on each other flip it flip it back around now it looks like that it's cool isn't it so you kind of see that middle line still so basically just fold it like an airplane start folding it like that make sure it's flat and good fold open it and do it basically like that ah uh, you can use a pen to stick in there or just your finger don't matter well it's not very pretty but We'll go with that. The better, the closer the middle up, the better it is. I'm sure you you might gonna going to have even better than mine, but it means it's, you are good if you are doing that well. So just bring it. So. To that thing, you see how it is. Same thing. Just need to unfold over here in the corner more. So you see how how much better it is than this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and fix that one. So okay, that's will do. Okay, now from that corner to that line, just fold it this way. This origami is pretty easy because most of the folds are very similar. Now you, you see that line, from that line to that point, just fold it, fold it that way. Just like that. Now you go. Get that corner and fold it like that. Just match it up with that thing. Just kind of smoosh it. Okay, and now get, get the put finger in over here and just unfold it and like pull it this way and make it flat. Fold. Okay. Do same on the all the other three sides. Doesn't have to be very super similar just just a little similar if it's a little bit different it's all good just don't worry about that okay two more sides i usually start from that corner and bring it to the end over here flood it down and match it with that well, you can do different way if you like it other way. It do doesn't really matter. Okay, four on four. Now bring that thing back and again. Squish it. So we got two angles right here like that. Okay, one more to go. Okay. Like that. That line over here. Unfold it all the way. Make sure I fold it this way. Squish it again. Uh, uh, other, other side like that. 
just bring it that corner just in the corner like that and squish it okay now pull it up when you pull it up just hold the finger at same distance and so they kind of match up over here too okay now it looks like that it's kind of cool fold already so now you go up two of this and close it oh that didn't unfold make sure everything is like folded close it back together like that okay we're gonna make head this part and just grab the corner fold it to the edge of the legs right here and then unfold this way just like that and pull out a little bit so it's gonna be like a head with the open jaw so now we're gonna to do legs just fold it in like that at least you don't have to but fold, fold it up and then this way so or you can do it longer you can decide the the length of the how tall is his legs like that okay same thing here close it make sure it's similar up up and and down like that Yep, go up like that in the corner and then just bring it down this way. So it looks like legs. Same thing on the back. Fold it in a little bit like that. Don't matter how much. Just to look good. Okay, bring that corner up like here. And then, while we hold that corner, bring it back down here, and then fold this corner, fold that one even more in there. Like that. Not the other one. Up. Make it similar to the other leg and down this way. And then fold part of his leg back over here. That's it, and I kind of smooshed it together, kind of pressed on it, so it's look, look cooler, just like that, make it a little rounder, a little bit teddy from this side. And if you want just glue it up over here and it's gonna look like a teddy okay thank you for watching subscribe favorite thumbs up and i'll see you tomorrow